Let's see children. What is this one trying to say? Quite good. For a trader, marked price of television set TV is rupees 15,680 inclusive of GST. So, mark price of TV is rupees 15,680 inclusive of GST at the rate of 12%. So, GST is 12% on the marked price. Suresh, a customer for this TV, asked the trader to reduce the mark price. He wants that the mark price should be reduced of TV to such an extent that its reduced price plus GST on it. Reduced price, new price, new reduced price plus GST on it should be equal to marked price. Find the required reduction. Right? So, if you have read the question completely, understood it very carefully, there are two things is what we are supposed to find out. Marked price and the reduction in the amount. We need to find out the marked price. Why? Because the entire question rolls about marked price. And we need to find out the reduction also. What reduction should be made? Right? Instead of this, a minor change, minor change in English is, the question might come out with, Suresh is asking for a discount so that the condition remains same. Find the required discount. So instead of reduction, discount. Meaning is the same. Right? Let's understand what you are supposed to find out. We are being told in this particular question that the for a trader, mark price of television is 15680, which includes, which is, which is inclusive of GST. Which, that means it includes GST. GST at that it what? 12%. So can I say, can I say, Price of television plus 12% GST is equals to 15680 as of now. So let the marked price, let the marked price be X. You can consider this price of television is nothing but marked price. So let the marked price be X. So is our sum going to modify to that is X plus 12 percent of X is 15680. X plus 12 by 100 of X is 15680. Right? So, can I say it is 1.12x is equals to 15680? Now, sir, what do you make? Uh, why, why do you want to say 1.12? It's simply 12 divided by 100 is 0 0.12. So, 1x plus 0.12x is 1.12x. 1x plus 12 by 100 is 0 0.12x. 1 plus 0.12 x is equals to 15680 upon 1.12 1 right x is equals to 15680 in 200 upon 112 we have removed the decimal we have removed the decimal so let's go for cancellation 7 7 16 8 times 7 2 times 14, 2 times 14, 4 times and 0. 16, 1 times, 16, 14 times is 224. 0 into 100, x is equals to, x is equals to 1, 4, 0, 0, 0. So what is X? Mark price. What is X? Mark price. So we say therefore marked price of television is rupees 14,000. Now children, some doesn't get over here. 
some says that the customer Suresh wants discount on this marked price such that a reduction in the marked price such that reduced price plus GST on the reduced price should be equal to mark price. That means he wants the amount of the television uh, set should be in that way that that amount plus 12% GST of that amount should be equal to 14,000. So we say let now let the reduction made reduction made B of rupees X. Let the reduction made be of rupees X. Therefore, what is the new marked price? New marked price. Since he wants a reduction, that's the reason I'm asking. I'm writing down new marked price. New marked price is 14,000 minus X because he wants some kind of reduction. The new marked price is going to be 14,000 minus X. Now what he says that on this marked price when GST is added, which is 12%, so the new marked price plus 12% GST on this particular marked price should be equal to marked price means 14,000. So now as per the condition stated also the sum says marked price new marked price 14,000 minus X plus 12% of 14,000 minus X should be equal to the marked price which is 14,000 should be equal to 14,000. So let's open down this 14,000 minus X plus 12%. So instead of off, ah, okay, fine. We'll write down in this way, 12 by 100 into 14,000 minus X. Right now, what will I consider on the same lines? is equals to 14,000 is equals to 14,000 mind you now do I have 14,000 minus X so one way is you open it 14,000 minus X plus 12 percent that is 12 into 14,000 by 100 and do it in that way right or what you can do is you can take 14,000 minus X common bracket 1 plus 12 by 100 is 14,000 14,000 minus X common. So when I take common entire bracket, one will be left plus 12 by 100. So is 14,000. So 14,000 minus X into, can I take LCM? So it's 112 by 100 is 14,000. Right. What next? Shall I just check this fellow here? Right. So what happens? It's 14,000 minus X. I'm keeping this as it is. I'm shifting this here. I'm bringing this down. Is equals to 14,000 into 100 upon 112. So 14,000 minus X is equals to how we go for calculation in this way here again 16 7 is 112 or 7 16 is a so 7 7 16 times 7 2 times 0 0 0 4 4 times 4 5 is a 4 1 times 4 25 times so 25 into 5, 1000, that 25 is a 125, 0, 0. So it's 12,500. X is equals to 14,000 minus 12,500. X is equals to rupees 1500. And what is X? What is X, children? X is nothing but the reduction which Suresh is demanding. What is X? X is nothing but the reduction which Suresh is demanding. Therefore, find the required reduction. Therefore, the required reduction, required reduction is rupees 1500. Therefore, the required reduction is rupees 1500. Right, children? A totally new sum. 
where by which we are asking for some kind of discount or reduction and the price including GST is given to us and we are asking something on reduction should be equal to the new mark price.